Get ready for something amazing this week on History Seekers. Bam! Musket ball. Big one. Andrew Jackson. I thought that was a shotgun shot. I almost threw that away. That is a stone right there. This thing could have been carried by Sam Houston. It could have been carried by Davy Crockett. Uh, Hey guys, I'm Heath Jones. I'm the producer of the History Seekers series on YouTube, also of the podcast on Spreaker. And we're gonna take you along on a journey. We're gonna start a series on Andrew Jackson. Andrew Jackson was the seventh president of the United States, but before that, he was a general in the army. And he was one of the most beloved heroes at one time. And later years, some people consider him a villain we're not gonna get into the political side of that, but we're gonna talk about the history. And we're gonna take you to what made Andrew Jackson famous and what probably led him to the presidency. And that's his victory over the Creek Indians in Alabama and later going on to New Orleans where he repelled the British and their invasion. You don't wanna miss the series. We're gonna be looking for camps that a lot of people don't know about camps that haven't been found before. So a lot of the people have found stuff around the forts that surrounded these battles, but we're gonna go for something a little harder. It's gonna be hard. We've already found some great stuff this past week during filming. We're gonna share it with you. You don't wanna miss this video. It's gonna be just a very fraction of some of the stuff we hope to come. Join us as we go on this series together. Thanks for watching. All right, guys. I just dug out something that's that looks old That doesn't look like most of the modern axes that you dig right there I thought it was just junk iron Doesn't look like junk iron uh, That might be good right there. I don't know how old that is. I don't know a lot about axes. We'll see I just dug this small round ball uh, they had some squirrel rifles and stuff like that as a bunch of volunteers, so could be related. I don't know. We'll wait till we see if we can find some more before we before we say it's related or not. But uh, first find, I don't know how Scott's doing. He, I've lost sight of him, so we'll see what we come up with. Where Andrew Jackson passed through. So I should have live dug this. It was a pretty good signal, but it was coming up at a solid 15, which is on the Equinox which is usually uh, a shotgun shell. So I didn't so I didn't live dig it. But when it came out of the hole, it made me know that, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to live dig 15s now. Now, to the untrained eye, it doesn't look like much, but this right here, whoops. That is a round ball, period, from Jackson. It's got some heavy mud and stuff on there, but that's what that is. Round ball from Andrew Jackson. This thing could have been carried by Sam Houston. It could have been carried by Davy Crockett. Uh, they were all here in Alabama, uh, Tennessee Volunteers with Andrew Jackson. So there you go. Great find. I'll see if I can live dig the, dig the next one. I don't know where Heath is. He's up there somewhere. Back at you. I'm here with Justin, and Justin has dug something worth this Andrew Jackson camp. I, I don't know. I mean, I don't think they would have made a metal arrow no, arrow at that thin, but it's really thin. But it's it's brass, isn't it? Yeah, it's brass. That's weird, huh? I mean, it's been it's been cut that way. It's been snipped. I don't know. Don't know if it's related, but it looks old. Yeah, it is. All right, let's see what else we can find. Okay. I got a really good signal here. Now, the last few times I've tried to live dig for you, it hasn't worked out. It's been various assorted things that are not what I'm looking for. So, we will see what this is. And live digging takes a lot of time, guys. Think about having to break the camera out every time you, you have something that looks worth 
exploring. Uh oh. Oh baby. Oh baby. Oh baby. Jackpot. Jackpot. Look at that. Beautiful. A beautiful round ball. Bam! Musket ball. Big one. Andrew Jackson. Oh, yeah. That's unmistakable. Now, you, you know, you saw the smaller one that I, that I got, and a lot of people would, um, you know, if you haven't looked at a lot of them, you might mistake that for like a shotgun, you know, like a double lot buckshot or whatever. But it's bigger than that. So the, 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 uh, the smaller one that I found earlier is definitely Jackson, but I'm going to tell you, there is no mistake in that one. That's a big boy. That's a great find. All right, we're gonna get back to it. Maybe I'm in a little hot spot here. Make sure I don't lose my round ball. We're gonna get back to it. Maybe I can find some, some greatness. Something right there. Came up a 25 on the Equinox. Let's see what it is. Let's do some quail hunting. Oh, don't, don't jinx me, Scott. Ooh. What is it? I don't know. I don't know what that is. Shotgun shell. Primer. I think. Wait, let me see. Let Here, me see. clean it off on camera. Oh, God. Uh, oh. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Man, that thing rang up really good. No? What is that? That's a ring, dude. That's a freaking ring. Look, I see the stone. Yep. Oh, pardon me, folks. Dude, could that be? Could that be a brass ring from Andrew Jackson era? I don't they know. Could, did dude. they have stones like that? Well, they certainly had rings. Well, yeah, but did they have stone? I thought that was a shotgun shell. I almost threw that away. That is a stone right there. It really is. And that, see the little design, see the little like lines or design yeah. on the side? Right Sweet. there. Sweet! Let me say, hang on. Yeah, there you go. Maybe it says A-J in there. Yeah, yeah. What, what, do, you, tell what do you think, A-J? Does it say A-J in there? Uh, well, I can't be that lucky. That's a, that is certainly, definitely, 100% a ring. All right, guys, we got a solid 18. We're down to it. There it is on the pinpoint. Is it going to be another shotgun shell? Let's see. Nope. Look right there. There it is. Look right there. Round ball. Yeah. Andrew Jackson era. Nice. Look at the seam. Oh, you can see the casting seam it looks like on it too. They would cast these in the field a lot of the times. Nice. It's not quite as big as some of them you see, but uh, that is still an Andrew Jackson era musket ball. I am hoping that ring that we found is as well. Don't know yet. Still waiting. Some of the people on the internet are saying it's 1700s. I don't know. I don't know anything about jewelry, but uh, this is definitely Andrew Jackson era. I'll take that. All right, guys, I've got a deep hole going on here. It was this iron signal. I knew it was an iron, but it just sounded so good. And I, I am about a foot and a half down-ish. I'm gonna drop the pinpointer in the hole. You can see, I mean, it's two pinpointers deep, at least two pinpointers deep. There it is, right there. It looks like that could be a sword blade or a saber. I don't know. We're at this Andrew Jackson camp. Uh, it may just be nothing. But man, that thing is down there. Of course, we're talking 1813, over 200 years ago. So, we'll see. I'm going to dig it out. And I'm going to try to just kind of get around it without breaking it there there you 
you see more of it coming out right there there we go oh well <laughs> it is not it is not a sword I, I don't know it's not a saber I don't know what that is though I have no idea what that is but it is odd and it was way down there doesn't look like a property stake I don't know anybody got any ideas uh, I'll be glad to hear them there it is let's we'll check that out I want to take that with me all right guys got something right there I'm just gonna see if we can move it around with my finger I don't know if you can tell on the camera or not but it is almost dark oh man that looks like another fired round ball probably it's smashed really good that's that's pretty cool you'll we'll have to clean it up to be sure and like I say it's kind of dark out here here comes Scott Scott I think I got another round ball over here it's fired it's uh flattened it hit something pretty good all right we'll clean that up